Why? Because University of Zambia is premier. University of Zambia is a public university which draws its money from the public coffers. So why is it that in one breath you are being given money in the other breath you're not given money because you are quasi government you are offering a service why do we always appeal to government government built this university government is a major stakeholder it sponsors the most students here it's, but also it's the one that benefits the most from our graduates doesn't it yeah. most of our graduates work in there including p1 himself is a graduate from here all his ministers and all these people that you see are shining here. They got in education from institutions like this. So it's a public good. So when we rise and unite and demand that, could we please be paid nine years? Can a minister last nine years? No, 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 no. A few years ago, one month, midterm graduate, asthma, BP. So if you don't come and offer solidarity like here, you are going to be ignored because Sometimes you get numbed with pain. So when we meet here, we remember, but we also give hope and we also demand. The last time that we were here, does anyone remember? Do we remember the last time we were here? November 2022, huh? two years ago. What was the struggle then? Money. To steal money. I mean, who can refuse money? Who wants money? Who wants money? Me, I want money. Huh? Is money enough? Uh, it will never be enough. But it's important that it's shared with everyone. There must be money for the investors of Zambia. And we can't be seeing the same song over and over and over again. So in 2022, we were here. For five days, we protested. Remember? What happened? You got some money. You got some money. Now, after these two years, yes, we've negotiated. We have uh, methodically presented our issues. We have looked at the framework. Uh, we have looked at the strategic plan. We have revised and varied the budget, and we have put in projections. But in Dalama, Ulibe, the budget has remained the same, even reduced. So if you don't show up and put pressure, no one is going to consider your case. They will prioritize. Upper University of Zambia, I think they are okay. Because Tina Vizungu Maningi, we just speak well, you see. We speak well. We present our issues very well. But we want money this time. 2022, we were here for five days. What came? 100 million was given. But was 100 million enough? No. No, no. no. it was a tip of the iceberg. Yes. For 2026, 2016 alone, we have 1,037 members who need to be paid. Gratuities, and pensions, to the tune of almost 200 million. What is 200 million to government? Tell me. Hmm? Eh? 200 million. It's a lot of money for Yunza. When it goes somewhere else, it's not a lot of money. So you must stand up and demand to say, we need to be considered also. If there's variation, if uh, there's a movement, you have to be considered. So from 2022, 100 million came. And when it came, we started fighting amongst ourselves. 100 million. So we are saying this time, let them give us more so that we don't fight. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? If they can give everyone, this one can go and finish his house. This one can go and do all sorts of things. So that's why trade unions combine, because there's strength in union density. We combine to bring these issues to the fore. And who are we fighting for? ourselves. Uh, some people say, ah, Ines, I can call more. You, you know, me, I'm almost retiring. You know, I, I don't understand uh, what these young people are, are going through. Uzakan kalamu na iwe. No, Shalimu, akabashani? Akabamu. Some people are saying, oh, I mean, I, I'm not concerned. Unfortunately, there's separation from the investor of Zambia. 
Wajuba peru. And now you are stranded, you are coming back. I need that gratuity. So even you, you are, if you think you are not affected, you will soon be. Almost everyone here is being old, including our former VC. You remember him? He was saying, oh, this is all going to happen. What happened? <laughs> I won't mention about the current one, because he knows that he's being, he's being old. Very soon, uh, his, his, his dues are going to be, to be calculated. So when we got the 100 million, who was one of the beneficiaries? Himself. <laughs> so the unions fight even on 